So, yo, we're beginning our journey on the road to Sonic X Shadow Generations, where we try to play as many Sonic Generations mods as we can before the game probably gets delisted. Today, we have multiple mods, but we're starting with the Sonic Adventure Gameplay Plus Emerald Coast mod. So let's just do it. Uh, uh, oh, what? It's classic Sonic in 3D. What? What is this? What is this motorbug doing? Why is he? <laughs> he really he just wants to take a dip. Oh my god. He can homing attack? Oh, what? Classic Sonic with a homing attack is freaking crazy. But yeah, this looks like Emerald Coast from SA1 to a T. I don't know if they just like ported it over or like remade um remade the stage like with new mod. I mean, it looks HD. It looks more HD than usual, right? I, mean, I, I have eyes. I can tell that. But like, yeah, this is this is actually so good. And I, I literally still can't get over seeing classic Sonic like this. This is actually insane. Wait, hold on, wait. You, you thought you were gonna live, buddy? You thought you were gonna live? Fuck your rockets. Oh my god. Dude, wow. Even in the mod. Dude, whenever I play SA1 Emerald Coast, like that part right there always gets me. And even in the mod, I couldn't escape it. Oh my god, I thought that killer whale was going to actually kill me just there in the air. That's what insane. Did we get the bridge part down? Did we get the bridge part? Yes, we did! That's freaking amazing. Yeah, we outran the f out of that whale. Oh, oh shit. Hit the, <laughs> hit the spring, please. Thank you. I gotta try not to curse so much because that just makes more work for me when I'm editing. But I don't know. It's just it's just in my it's in my vernacular. I'm sorry, I'm not a very articulate person. Oh, we even have like the, the second the second section with the hold on, hit can I hit the wall run? Can I make it up in the hole up here? Yes, sir. We can. Oh, oh, boing, boing, boing. This is pretty good. This is a pretty good, like, one-to-one -one with Emerald Coast. Like, it is, like, to a T. It's Emerald Coast in Sonic Generations with a 3D moving Classic Sonic. I like the fact that they used Classic Sonic, too. Wait. Oh, oh it, his spin dash. I didn't even know he could do his spin dash in 3D. I didn't even, tr like, try to. I just thought about it. I was like, wait, what if he could boost on this stage? That'd be freaking insane. But yeah, it, it's freaking awesome that they used Classic Sonic uh, to, like, kind of represent, like, kind of the, the how smaller the Dreamcast Sonic model was. Um, and, and, the, and the original, I say, can we do this? Oh, we can. Oh, my God. This is actually such a polished mod. This is so insane, dude. Actually, I, I, I'm having a super good time. Oh, wait, we're about to reach the end of the level. Uh, it's just the glow ring. I think it would have been cool if they put like tails in his like crash plane here. I don't know if that's even possible. I'm not demeriting points for that, but still, this was freaking awesome. We definitely got an S rank though, right? Yeah, stop playing with your boy. Look, look at, look at him. 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 He's so freaking happy. <laughs> So here we are with the next mod, or I guess I should say mods, because we kind of have a two-in-one deal going on here. Um, we have the Water Palace revamp mod, which basically takes uh, Water Palace from uh, Sonic Rush and makes it playable here, I guess. And uh, in order to suit this mod, what would be more fitting than having a Blaze mod here? So we have the true Blaze mod, and you can actually configure which kind of Blaze you want. Um, there's you can get Generations Blaze, 06 Blaze, or Sonic Rush Blaze. Obviously, I'm using Sonic Rush Blaze because um, I thought that'd just be the most fitting here. Um, so what, what does it say? Welcome to Water Palace. Please play with the better FX Pipeline mod, which I am doing. Um, made by Skype for the best graphical experience. After completing the level once, five red rings will appear. Try to find them all. It isn't too easy. Gather them to unlock the acceleration skill in the skill shop. Have fun and thank you for playing. Okay, let's just let's do it. You can now buy this new skill time break. Please check out my shop whenever you can. Okay. It looks like we have our own little we're own, we have our own little hub world thing going on. This is oh oh my god. Again. <laughs> okay, not only did I just die in the hub world, Blaze said again. Does she wanna die again? Is she okay? Blaze, you can talk to me. You you are you are worth it. You you're you are worth it. To all my viewers out there. Look, 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 look at Blaze. Just like her, you are worth it. It's actually funny. I went the longest time playing Sonic Generations not knowing about skills, like at all. I didn't even factor this in. I was just playing the game. Okay, so, oh, oh okay, okay. A little, a little, a little flashy. Stunning on me, oh, let's do it. So, oh, wow. Okay, 
So, so, I, I haven't really played Sonic Rush. Actually, no, I'm fucking capping. I, I have played Sonic Rush, but I never like completely played it. I never played it to completion. I, uh, I actually played it on like an emulator. Actually, it's funny. There's like a website out there that lets you play like older Sonic games, like just straight on the website. Like the website emulates the game on the website, so you don't have to actually download like a dedicated like Nintendo DS emulator or something. You can go to that website and play Sonic Rush or like Sonic Drift, Sonic Labyrinth and stuff, which is actually really, really, really cool. It even works with like a controller and stuff, but on that website is where I played a bit of Sonic Rush. I think I got like, I finished the boss fight, like the first Eggman boss fight with Sonic. And then I, uh, and then I got to Water Palace, but like, I just stopped playing from there. Not because I didn't like it or anything, but just because like, I don't know, I just have to, I didn't, I just didn't have the patience during that time to play. Oh my gosh. Oh. What? 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 Hold on, wait, I'm jumping over these. <laughs> what the hell? Um, yeah, I, I just didn't have the patience to just play Sonic Rush at that moment, uh, I guess. Um, so I never finished it, but I might go back and like, just go play Sonic Rush to completion. That might be fun. Um, I hear Sonic Rush is probably, is, I, I've heard a lot about Sonic Rush over the time of my, are we good? Oh, okay, I, I got scared for a second. Um, but yeah, I, I wanna go, I'm gonna go back and play Sonic Rush. Blaze is actually like, Bla I've always treated Blaze as a very like, she's a cool character that just shows up, you know what I mean? She's like, oh, it's Blaze, cool. But Blaze actually has like a die-hard like, freaking like, fan base. Oh, oh, oh my god, oh my god! <laughs> I did not hit the grind in time. Um, but yeah, Blaze has a like, a, a, a super die-hard like, fan base for uh, her. There's a ton of people that really, really, really love her character and like, dedicated to her. Um, which is so insane. I mean, I guess she's not really special in that regard. There's tons of people that fuck with Blaze. Um, or there's tons of people that fuck with like, uh, tons of different Sonic characters that I don't, I didn't never really give a, like a passing glance. Like, there are some people that mess with Oma Chow, which I feel like I gotta sit down and like, talk to them. You know what I mean? Cause like, oh wait, hold on. Hold on, buddy. You, th you, you thought you were just gonna, you, in fact, no, all of you need to die now. Hold on, we're, we're fucking Blaze. I'm gonna kill all of you. But yeah, there's some, but yeah, there's people that like dedicate their shits to like Oma Chow, and I'm just kind of like Oma Chow. Like I can understand cheese maybe with cream, but like Oma Chow. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we we beat the level and didn't get an A rank because uh, an S rank because we fucking died. But it it is it is whatever. Gosh, and that was the Water Palace revamp mod and the True Blaze mod. Um. I could go back in and get the red rings, but to be honest, I just wanted to showcase the, the mod and the stage and everything like that. Um, I might go back and get the red rings on my own time, or maybe if you guys would like to see me try this mod this mod again, and like a little video of me trying to get the red rings in this mod while I just ramble, um, we can do that too. But anyway, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. This is the start of the Road to Sonic X Shadow Generation series. And I just want to show off as many mods as possible before the game possibly gets delisted. The modding community put a lot of hard work since 2011. They put a lot of hard work into this game. And it's I think it's important that old and new we just showcase as much as we can to give them love and to get any, any new players, any new people uh, that, you know, have, have seen Sonic Generations that don't own it. Um, I want them to watch this series and let this incentivize them to go on Steam and buy the game and try out the mods yourself. Um, before it's too late um, and even if and even if the game ends up not getting delisted because we're not certain it's going to be which is kind of looking that way but even if Sonic Generations ends up not being delisted this will still be a fun thing a fun awesome thing to do for the modding community and just just fun for me I love playing this shit. so um yeah anyway thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one <laughs>